What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to show to you how to jailbreak the new iOS 11.2.5 and I will be doing this on my iPhone SE. Now what you do is simply start your Safari browser. Um, now of course you don't need a um, you don't need a computer for this and it's also fully untethered. So uh, to start off, go to pangu11.mobile and uh, here you will get an explanation how it works and they will tell you that uh, you can't install Cydia on a device that hasn't been jailbroken, jailbroken sorry. but you can install apps that has been approved by Apple. So the Pangu team simply hid the jailbreak inside of approved applications, inside applications that they can install. So when you start those applications, the jailbreak and the installation of Cydia will start in the background. So go to pangu11.mobile, scroll to the bottom, and click on this little icon here. And uh, yeah, they will also explain that uh, the app sometimes gets patched and blah blah blah, you can read it yourself. So just click here, the link to get a random Cydia injected uh, app. And if you come to a site like this, stupid servicing stuff, then just ignore them. I don't know why they come up, they, they got nothing to do with the jailbreak. So, no stupid surveys, no... Don't add your phone number and crap like that. If that shit come up, just... Just go back. Uh, of course, it had to mess with me when I'm making a video. There we go. Now, all of all of these uh, apps of co are of course free and they are uh, injected with uh, Cydia and um, the jailbreak. And now when you start this jailbreak, you will also start the jailbreak process and installation of Cydia in the background. So what you need to do is download an uh, injected app, uh, a jailbreak injected app, and start it up and let it run for about 30 seconds to get the jailbreak time to install itself. And then reboot your device and you should be done. Sometimes Apple patches these apps, uh, meaning that the first app might not work and the second app might not work. Uh, usually the first app works, but sometimes you need to try um, a few times before you get it to work. And um, this is also an untethered jailbreak, meaning that if your battery runs out or if you accidentally turn off your phone um, or iPad, then uh, you can simply start it up again and it's good to go. You don't need to re-jailbreak it or start an app or anything like that to use it. You can restart it whenever you want. And it should be done soon. You will see if the jailbreak works or not when you're restarting your device. Be done soon. And if you wonder what, about that blinking thing, it's the proximity sensor, and you can't see it with your naked eye. So um, I've heard some funny <laughs> accusations before that I have a fake iPhone and stuff like that, uh, because I don't see the blinking on my phone. Uh, you can't see that blinking with your naked eye. It's the proximity sensor. Google it before you start saying stupid things. Okay. You can only see, you can see it on recorded videos of the phone. There you can see it quite clearly, like in this video, but you can't see it with your naked eye. And now we just start it up. And right now, in the background, the jailbreak and um, the jailbreak and the Cydia installation 
is uh, going on in the background. So, um, you don't need to do anything in the game. Um, the most important thing is that you uh, keep the game up and running for about 30 seconds. Um, doesn't matter if you click around or not, but you don't need to. It, basically, what's important is that you start the app and keep it running for about 30 seconds. And I think the jailbreak has done its part by now. So now I'm simply going to restart it by holding the power button. And then uh, when the phone has uh, shut down, I'm simply going to start it up again. And now we shall see soon if the jailbreak worked or not. That's the Tengu symbol, so that's a good sign. And here we go. There's Celia. And we are now officially jailbroken on the new iOS 11.2.5. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, put them in the comment section below. Um, thank you for watching and have a great day. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. See ya.